here we go. Elevate on three, one, two, three. Elevate! The spiders. I have no idea what number we were on. In her eight seasons as the Spiders head coach, Richmond has never finished lower than third in the A-10 regular season. The Spiders have won three A-10 regular season titles, three A-10 tournament titles, and three NCAA bids. Her win on Sunday versus Drexel was Gina Lacido's 100th career victory. I think, you know, I have to say that you don't get to 100, you know, without all of my former players, um, you know, Jody Murphy, Ryan Allen, Kristen O'Rourke, these assistants that I've been really fortunate. I haven't had a lot of transition and um, all of these people have catapulted us to here. And, you know, as a coach, it took me a moment today when I realized that, wow, this is what we could accomplish today. You know, that's how that happens. And I do, I just, I feel really fortunate to be the face on the program, but, um, I didn't get myself here, you know, and so all of those people contribute to that, and I just hope that they feel that with us. She just puts her life into this team, and it's amazing to see it paying off, and the team loves Coach Gina, and players past and present have contributed to the success, so it's it's a really big thing for the Richmond program to get 100 wins, and I'm thrilled for her. It means everything. It's fantastic. She's such a great coach, just from a field hockey standpoint and just as a person, she's such a good coach, and so we get just as excited as she does every time. Like whenever we pull a win out, it's like such a communal just excitement. And so we're just like, it's awesome that she's pulling out, that we're getting wins and that she's helping us get these wins. So it's really good. The victory on Sunday was also the Spiders' second win of the season. A very, very young team that has won their first two games. I think that is a, is a testament to the team and really responding to um, a new attacking style that we have. As we've commented, we lost a lot of you know, firepower on our forward line, but it's really just a commitment as a team. We want to be an attacking team. And so to be able to accomplish that in opening weekend, it makes our staff, we're, we're so proud, but we're eager. They're really being very teachable. And I said, and, and putting in place the kind of things that we know are going to be necessary to be a postseason team. So that's um, that's that's an exciting accomplishment, you know, early on in the season.